Merry Christmas, wishing you and your family health, happiness, peace and prosperity this holiday season and in the coming new year. May the magic of Christmas fill your heart all year long. Hi, good morning, good afternoon and good evening. Whatever time it is for you in your geographical location, you are welcome to the short word for today's audio daily devotion. This is an audio narration of the written short word for today's daily devotion published every day and sent to our subscribers. One word from God can do more than a million human words to relieve a distressed soul. You are not here today by accident. God has predestined you and he has a word for you. The foundation of the short word for today is Luke chapter 4 verses 18 and 19. Quoting from the King James Version, quote, The Spirit of the Lord is upon me, because He had anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He had sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to preach deliverance to the captives and recovering of sight to the blind, to set at liberty them that are bruised, to preach the acceptable year of the Lord. Unquote. You can help spread the faith by subscribing to our YouTube channel and sharing the link with your friends and loved ones. If you have not already subscribed, please do so and click the bell icon so you can receive instant notification anytime we publish a new series. Thank you and God bless you. The affirmation for this week's show word for today, God made everything beautiful. The show word for today devotion is a reading of the show word for today's devotion published every day on our website. You can visit our website for more resources. If you want to send in your prayer request, feel free as you take the time to fill out the prayer request form on our home page at www.theshoreword.com. .org.uk. Welcome to the reading of the Word of God for the Sure Word for Today. The Sure Word for Today is the abundance of the free favor of the Lord. This week's title for the Sure Word for Today's series is In His Time, Part 7 of 7. All Bible quotations are from the King James Version unless otherwise stated. This week's Bible verse is from the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 3, verse 11. Here is the Bible verse quote. He had made everything beautiful in his time. Also, he has set the world in their heart so that no man can find out the work that God maketh from the beginning to the end. Unquote. The most challenging place to be in your life is God's waiting room. We must never get tired of doing what is right and good, for when the time is right, we will reap a harvest of blessings if we don't give up or quit. God is never in a hurry and He is never late and His timing is not always convenient. Consequently, in the storms of life, we can trust God, be patient and humble, count on God's promises and keep our eyes on Him. God is never impatient and his timing is not rushed. The schedule of God is all about his caring for us. You must learn to be patient with the process. We now live in a fast-paced society where we are made to look like fools if we are patient. It used to be the patient dog eating the fattest bone, but now the patient dog starves. You need to develop patience if you want to succeed in any endeavor in life. Tolerance is vital when you are waiting on the Lord. Even when you don't understand God's timing, trust in the Lord with all your heart and mind so He can direct your path. The timing of God is honest. There are no games involved in His timing of things. He does not manipulate the truth to please you. You need to understand that everything in life revolves around time and chance. All you need is to be prepared. You will always be successful 
when your preparation meets with opportunity. Sometimes, an opportunity may take time, but it is there. You will miss every opportunity life throws at you if you have not taken the time to prepare. If you care, you will make time. God values everything about you. So, don't be discouraged about your current state. God has a prospect for your life. He sent his only begotten son, Jesus, to die for your sin. When things are not working out for you, it is not because it is not working, but because it will make it beautiful in his time. We have reached the end of the Sure World Audio Devotion series titled In His Time. We are getting ready to read God's words, the Sure Word Capsule by Jefferson Otombara Ingbi. I would like you to read this at least once, twice, or three times a day. Whatever you are going through, this word will help you. If you start with me and repeat every word that I read, you will be blessed. Do not leave gaps in this recording. I will join you to repeat the short word capsule. This is the day the Lord has made. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I am my superhero. I am my superhero. I refuse to give up. I refuse to give up because I have not tried all possible ways. Because I have not tried all possible ways. I am adventurous. I am adventurous. I overcome fear by following my dreams. I overcome fear by following my dreams. I will not compare myself to strangers on the internet. I will not compare myself to strangers on the internet. I will not compare myself to anyone. I will not compare myself to anyone. I am a loving person. I am a loving person. I am purposeful. I am purposeful. I am created with divine intention. I am created with divine intention. I feed my spirit. I feed my spirit. I train my body. I train my body. I focus my mind. I focus my mind. It is my time to excel. It is my time to excel. I am in charge of how I feel. I am in charge of how I feel. And today, I am choosing happiness. And today, I am choosing happiness. I have the power to create change. I have the power to create change. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I deserve the best. I deserve the best. And I accept the best now. And I accept the best now. I get things done fast. I get things done fast. I never put things off. I never put things off. I am a doer. I am a doer. I act quickly. I act quickly. I am motivated to finish my tax. I am motivated to finish my tax. I have the willpower to do my assignments. I have the willpower to do my assignments. I am a proactive person. I am a proactive person. I am fully committed to achieving my goals. I am fully committed to achieving my goals. I cast unto God, I cast unto God, every anxiety and depression. Every anxiety and depression. I am feeling right now. I am feeling right now. And the Lord has embraced. And the Lord has embraced. Extinguish. Extinguish and crushed the anxiety and depression. And crushed the anxiety and depression. I am like a tree planted. I am like a tree planted. By the rivers of water. By the rivers of water. I bring forth fruit. I bring forth fruit in my season, in my season. My leaf shall not wither, my leaf shall not wither. And whatsoever I do will prosper, and whatsoever I do will prosper. The grace of God, the grace of God makes my mistakes prosper, makes my mistakes prosper. 
I walk in the light of the word of God. I walk in the light of the word of God and live by the word of faith and live by the word of faith. I declare that today, I declare that today, this city and country I live in, this city and country I live in, we yield its fruit for me, we yield its fruit for me, and I shall eat my fill, and I shall eat my fill, and dwell in this city and country in safety, and dwell in this city and country in safety. I am not sick, I am not sick. My Lord has healed me of all kinds of disease. My Lord has healed me of all kinds of disease. God has not given me a spirit of fear. God has not given me a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. But of power, love, and a sound mind. I overcome every fear with the blood of Jesus. I overcome every fear with the blood of Jesus. I decree and declare that I have a sound mind. I decree and declare that I have a sound mind. By faith, by faith, we believe that those things we pray, we believe that those things we pray, we receive, we receive, and we have them, and we have them in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. We have reached the end of the Sure Word Audio Devotion and the Declaration of the Sure Word Capsule. Please visit www.thesureword.org.uk for more capsules tailored to meet your specific needs. You can also put a request for a capsule to be created for any challenge you are having. Thank you for listening and confessing along. Please, don't forget to share this audio devotion. I would also love it if you can subscribe and click the bell icon so you can get the notification anytime we post a new audio devotion. Have a gorgeous day and may God continue to bless you, enlarge your coast and increase your substance. Amen.